Hello, hello, hello. Um, I've been asked to show you how to open oysters. So I have a dozen lovely fresh oysters and I'm going to show you how to open a few. But first let's um, have a look at the anatomy of an oyster and what it looks like and where you're meant to open. So basically the oyster uh, looks like this. You want to be opening the shell so that the actual flesh of the oyster, the actual mollusk, is sat in like a little, is a little tray. So if you look at the shape, you don't want to open it that way up. You want to open it this way up. So it's got the this shape at the bottom. Okay. And then you'll see the little hinge. So here's the little hinge just here. And this is where you want to be putting your knife in, anywhere around about that hinge. There. So you want a cloth to grip the oyster shell with, like so. And then you get your knife in to this point just here. twist it in once he's he's in and you just give him a little flick like that and he's popped and you want to just work that knife around broke put the knife around and the shell shut up straighten that in there now you don't want any shell in the oyster so this comes on good on good faith from a Frenchman who showed me how to open oysters. And what you literally do under a rain tap is just rinse out the, any sand or shell particle that might have got in there when it was growing or in the opening process. So it's all rinsed out. So you can leave that in the shell like that Put him in the little dish and he will rejuice again because obviously you want the juice in the oyster shell. So we'll open another. See, again, the shape. So you've got the flat bit as the top, curvy bit as the bottom. So you want, want to open the top lid. So Knife in there. Click him up and leave a Nice one. Take the shell out. Rinse. Any bits of sand or shell in there can come out. And put on the oyster dish. Do one more.
cooking and just rinse all that and we'll juice up again So basically, we've done the oysters. I'm just going to show you how to prepare the little sauce that goes with it now, which is a little like marinade sauce, which is made of a shallot, one shallot, and some red wine vinegar. So I just pop up the shallot. That's your shallot. Again on this quarter half, just chop up lightly. You can do this as fine or as or as lumpy as you like. I don't like it too fine, so I just half and quarter, and then just chop. So, there we have. And as you see, the oysters are all juiced up again. And with a nice bottle of white wine, I'm absolutely happy for the night. Bon appetit.